Hey guys, and welcome back to Terror from the Deep. I have moved my microphone, I think it's in a better position, but uh, you'll have to let me know. Um, so this new computer I've got set up, uh, it does not seem to like recording, uh, recording, rendering my videos. Uh, it seems to overheat and shut down. Um, every time I go to render a video, which we did know was a problem with it, but I was hoping that new case, better airflow, blah, 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 might be better, but no. Anyway, I'm going to have to record and... <laughs> okay, so here's my production pipeline. I record my videos on my Frankenstein PC. I then put them on my laptop um, to, <laughs> to render. Um, yeah, and then I transfer them to my phone so I can go into town to upload them. Wow. Yep, that's how we're doing it. We are certainly living in the year 3020. Yes, men. Anyway, let's move up. So it was kind of a disaster last round. Uh, <laughs> yeah, we got fragged hardcore, uh, but you know that's fine. That's fine. We we are expecting uh, casualties. We're expecting lots of casualties. H is bringing up the rear. He's rocking the rocket launcher or the torp launcher, I should say. So I mean, we could go into this through the front, or we can just fucking walk in through the big old that our Barracuda made in the side. Four rounds? Oh, right, yeah, I was going to say four rounds. That's because they were going berserk. It was an utter shit show, wasn't it? Yeah, and we had a couple of guys uh, this side of the map that were trying to hunt down, like, a single Aquatoid. What are you loaded with? Oh, you got standard rounds. You know, that's okay. That's okay. We've got, like, one Aquatoid over here. He's fragged. He's literally been blasted into last week, which is fine. Uh, Emil, what are you rocking? You're rocking the explosive rounds. Okay, let's move you up a little bit. I don't want to go too crazy with these guys, because... Especially Emil. You're... Ah, oh, shit. You got no nades and nothing. Well, we might be able to... No, we got no one. We're really spread thin here. I don't like it. No, sir. Don't panic. Why are you panicking? Oh. Dude, look, we've got this under control. He lied. Oh, my God. Okay. Oh, let's get some more cover going, shall we? Try and cover our advance just a little bit. You knobhead. Honestly. God. Testicular fortitude. Do you have it? Right. This area is fairly clear so far. Oh, there's not a lot we can do. We can bring H up. I, I want to be careful with H. Because he's carrying the package, shall we say. He's the only one that... Um, can really do much. He is our force multiplier right here. Ah, oh, don't panic! No! <laughs> no, 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 no! You fools! God, I asked for soldiers and you semi morons. Um, how are you feeling? You found your bollocks. Go back here, pick up your gun. And you have no TUs left. Wonderful. Who else is left? Hmm. Well, Libov, you aren't too bad. Let's get you up and around there. Anything? This sneaky son of a bitch can be hiding anywhere. I don't like it. No, sir. I don't like it. Alright. Stay frosty. You still freaked out. 
Oh, God. H. Who can you even breach? Ah, oh, it's the guy that... One of the breach team has panicked. Okay, let's get up to the sub. Okay, get you at least in cover. H, move up behind. Be careful though, bro. End the turn. Oh my god. I'm so nervous every time I click end turn. My god, I'm literally like shitting myself. And that's the magic of this game. Uh, and I think that was lost in the uh, in the reboots, you know? That tension. There's so much of it. Ah, uh, this could be a viper's nest, all right. Holy shit. Oof, oof. Okay. Why is your morale so low? Like, I know what happened was bad, okay. But in the grand scheme of XCOM, it wasn't that bad. It's so bizarre to be recording my videos at a desk, honestly. With monitors, it's so nice. Um, right, Mikhail. I want you to move up. I want you to stay behind these boys. Um, Alright, you've calmed the fuck down. Go get your weapon. Cormac. Come on, Cormac. Come on. With a name that hardcore, you shouldn't be shitting in your pants. Oof. Uh, kind of almost ready to breach. I want H to get a good position here. But he's so exposed out here. Well, I mean, we've got the cloning bats warmed up. Ooh. There's at least two KIA in there, which is nice. Right, pick up your weapon, dude. Grab it. Get back in there. Who hasn't moved? I think everyone's moved now. Cormac has moved. Only you, but I don't really want you to move because... Oh, okay. Maybe... Maybe you should have moved. Everyone's panicking. <laughs> Everyone's panicking. Stop panicking. Oh man, I don't even know where he got hit from. Did he get hit from over here? It's almost like he came from in here though. H, get around in there. No line of fire. Oof. Solid hit on the insides, but... No dead aliens. Call back, you... Um, things aren't going well. Uh, we need to get some kills. Because killing aliens will bolster our morale. Oof, okay. Move up. Do we have anyone left? I get the feeling H is about to die. Yep. Oh man. You can see him. There he is! Fuck did you come from? Right, let's nade this guy. Fuck you, pal. Okay. Guys, guys. Okay, look. I appreciate the fact you're panicking and you're really concerned over what's happening. Um that's fair. But if you're running around on the bottom of the sea without a weapon then you are going to die. It is a guarantee. Your weapon is empty. Is this mission FUBAR? 
<laughs> I mean, yes. But can we even pull this back? Stop, stop. Nope. Misclicked. Two misclicked. Right, he's found his nuts. The trouble is, there's so much smoke and debris. Move up. Now. Oof. Oh, oh. We see him. We see him. I think. Right. Guys. Oh, you. Pick up your weapon. That's yours, buddy. Right. Contact. The little turds right down there. Do we have any nades? Yes. You ready? Come on. There we go. Oh, Jesus. Okay. We got that through grenade victory, which... Hey, we actually got the Zubite from that as well. Well, the Zerbite. Zerbite is absolutely... Um, required in this game that is basically the alien power source we need that stuff aqua uh, plastics is also very much needed we lost seven guys holy shit that was not good <sighs> dude they pretty much rolled over us there. And we used a lot of materials here as well. Okay. Well, Mill got promoted, so I mean, that's something that happened. H! No! Oh, wait, hang on. When you fired the torpedo, did you get a kill? guess so well I mean we need I was gonna say what we might do actually we need ammunition for oh we don't have storage space for that oh damn That's a problem. Well, so we lost seven. So let's get another seven to replace the ones we lost. That should be fine. Um, I also, how much, yeah, Aquajet torpedoes. These things are expensive. Let's get the one with the solid harpoon bolts. Ah, we don't have enough storage space. That's a kick in the knickers. Well, we're going to have to make do for now. That was not great. We do have research going, don't we? We do. Particle disturbance. How much... Uh, 10 scientists okay so we've still got like 18 slots stores are actually overloaded let's get some more um, let's get some more scientists some more technicians okay let's go for that for now now, what do we have here? Cell sack. Got to have something in here that's no use. Sonic pulses will keep Zerb... Oh, yeah, of course, the Zerbite. That, yeah, 50 units of Zerbite does take up a lot of space. We definitely don't need five Aquatoid stiffs. 
So we've got the Sonic Pistols. Which we're never actually going to use those. So we can sell that. Sonic Blaster Rifles. Yeah, we hold on to those. That's not too bad. We made, made a good bit of scratch there. Can we now afford... That... That bad boy. No. Um... Base information. Yeah, so we're still like overloaded in the stores. We really need the general storeroom back online. We also um, I always like having lots of storage, guys. Like it's so important. Uh, okay, cool. So now we've got general stores online because each one allows us to have uh, They are in the way cool Each one allows us to have 50 So now we've actually got like a uh, hundred storage space cool. Okay, so Purchase now this is going to be expensive. We do need to get a, a handle on our finances And that will come in to its own soon Because XCOM is going to become um, the biggest arms manufacturer the world has ever seen Okay, go to base Aquanauts we need someone with good, someone with good accuracy. We've got a 60, another 60, 61, We've got a 61. All right, welcome back H. I don't know what to put. Two, I suppose. H2. Yeah. H2. Welcome back, buddy. Welcome back. Okay, cool. Now we wait. Hopefully, right, more scientists and technicians, that's cool. Um, research, poor, yeah, we need to get average, that's fine. Can we actually manufacture anything to start off with? Don't think we can, new production, no. That's unfortunate. So now we wait. Hey, nice, okay, that's fine. Oh no. Oh, guys, we've just got the shittiest, most unlucky roll with that. Terror attacks usually happen at the end of the month. They do happen mid-month, but it's very rare. Oh, no. No, 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 no. trying to think what we can do about this uh, okay fine and it's <sighs> um... because we will get a massive penalty if we don't do that Shit. All right, let's get everyone on board. Space available for. That's fine because. Not enough ammunition to arm it. Oh, that's fine. 
I didn't know that we ah bollocks. I assumed it would come with um. Can you not take it even if it doesn't have enough ammo? That's a little bit sucky. Okay, well this mission just got worse. Oh boy. Uh, I guess we need ammunition for our solid harpoon bolts. Like, is each one of these a reload? Okay. Well. Here we go. Best thing to do here might be to land and then say, see you later, pal. Because this is going to be an island map as well. Aliens have launched an attack against the surface site. The port and its civilian population have been put at risk. Your squad must eliminate all aliens and protect the innocent bystanders from this alien incursion. Yeah. Oh, you're, you've got a lot of weight to you, actually. Um, let's give you some nades. What about you? I'm pretty sure it takes less TUs. Ah, is that all the grenades we got? Shit. She bought some more. Grenades in this game are really clutch. They're really, really useful. Um, it's so annoying. Right, let's do that. We do have fire ammo. Which is nice. What have we got here? What have you loaded with? Okay. Well. Oh boy. C1, what is it? Oh, Gilman. Oh, that's a solid hit. I'll take it. Solid hit. Are we in the corner? We're not in the corner, are we? No. No. Christ, that guy just literally shit himself. I'm not surprised. Um. Okay. Duck. We need to get a couple of rounds in there. Okay, get your head down. Got another civilian there. Let's try and get these guys in some sort of some sort of formation. But we, that that building's going to be trouble. We need to get some explosives in there. Now we know that the aliens already have grenades. Which is problematic. Why? Hang on. Why? I click there. And he, that's interesting. Don't remember that being a thing. Okay, let's get some smoke. See what happens. I have a feeling it's gonna be a slaughter fest. But. Okay. Oof. Oh god. Get your heads down, guys. Come on. 
Ooh. Whoa. <laughs> well, Sarah from the deep. Terror from the deep. Um, get a shot up there. He did not actually hit anything. Oh man. Shit. There he is. Come on. Right. Deep one down. Okay. Aru, good shooting. Good shooting, buddy. We're gonna we're gonna need some more of that. Now, we've got another sneaky little turd out here somewhere. Oh my dudes. Right, let's line up the next load of meat for the grinder. Unfortunately, we're just going to be going through so many recruits. And that's Terror from the Deep. You're not armed. Okay. Come on. Was that one of us? That was one of us, wasn't it? That was one of us. Was that one of us? <sighs> yeah, I think that was. What are you doing there? You just got like a random zivvy. Oh, hi, friend. Oh, Jesus. Danger close. What are you rocking? Explosive rounds. Oh, Jesus Christ. Um... <laughs> well, that was between his legs. I mean, sure. This guy needs to die. <clears throat> this guy needs to die. No, 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 you're, you're not, you're not quite understanding the gravity of the situation here. Okay, it's not a suggestion, it's a requirement. Uh, this guy, 22 TUs, right, prime... She's got six left. I mean, she can throw it next turn. What are you armed with? Normal rounds. You haven't got a grenade. Who's got a grenade? Let's get you out. Someone's got to have a grenade. You do. Right. Prime the grenade. Uh, I think that's there. That was not a great throw. It was enough. It was enough. Oh, Jesus. I can't stand deep ones. Oh my god. They are so savage, guys. Right. Anyway, we are out of time once again. So, I'm going to have to leave this video here. Um, <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, when we come back, we will be... Um, 
Uh, we will be coming back to this nightmare. Uh, I don't know how this is going to go. To be honest. I... E ooh, ugh, ooh. Oofed. Ah, shit. We need to do some scouting. We need to get some eyes on. And we need to do some damage. Um, deep ones are vicious. They are so accurate. Uh, their hits are basically one hit kills as we've seen. We lack the firepower to do an awful lot against them. But this is what I like about XCOM. The original XCOM. So you talk about edge of your seat stuff. Anyway guys, thank you very much for watching. And as always, till next time.